What's up everybody? It's Common Sense Investor coming at you with another video. In this video we're going to talk about the Mullen stock, what's going on with it, and how I'm tracking it using this ChatGPT made AI moving average. All right. Now what it does, what makes this different than any other moving average people is that it's AI, which means what? It learns. It it teaches itself and it goes throughout the day and it will correct itself from a slow EMA length of 119 and it may switch up to 147 because it's filtering in market news and other stock movements such as the S&P 500 and all that other shit. It does all of that, all right? And I've tracked it using Mullen over the last two days and I've had some really good success with it. Now, I got in Mullen before the reverse stock split. Then when, when it reversed stock split, I, it was around $3.12 or something like that that I had after the reverse stock split was my average. Then I bought that stock because they were going to go through a reverse stock split. And I wanted to have some kind of position in it so I could see and have skin in the game to watch that stock and how it performed after the reverse stock split. And my stock went from $3.12 on an average to $0.10. Cents. It was devastating to watch. But I just, I only had a few dollars in there. It was no big deal. But I know a lot of people had a lot of money in it. But it fell all the way down to ten cents, and I was listening to Cowboy Clown, and as usual, he's telling us not to buy. And I'm very cautious because I know that he's right when he says just because a stock is cheap don't mean you have to buy it. And I've learned that lesson with Highcroft and Sundial. But at ten cents, and I'm going, man, you can get ten for a dollar. What a fucking deal, man? It can't go, and I'm only gonna put in enough where if it went to zero, I wouldn't be too pissed. So I got a position in Mullen at $0.10. Cents. Now what happened was it brought my $3.12 uh, average all the way down to where it was 11 something, 11, let me look, 11.04 was my average after I averaged it down from at the reverse stock split average, all right? So I got it all the way down to 11.04, and when it shot up, I was like, oh, yeah, I was in on that shit. And I came over here, and I remembered the damn AI moving average that I had. So I began to watch it, and it tracked perfectly. And that's throughout the day, I seen how it was moving, and I said, well, wait a minute. If this is right, then I can scalp it. So today, when it ran up to like 28, I sold, all right? And when it crossed right here, so on that, on that red bar, underneath my AI moving average, this red bar told me it was fixing to fall. So I sold, and I took my profits, and I put in eight. All right, and I waited, and when it started falling, started falling, I was watching this AI moving average, and when it gave me the signal to buy in again, I bought in again, and then my new average became twenty three nineteen. All right, so now I've got more shares of Mullen than what I started with because I sold at the top using this indicator, and I bought back in right here. And it's brought my average to this right here. And it's breaking out now. Now, what we needed to do is, let me see, I'm on the five minute. I watch it on the three minute. I just follow the pattern easier, all right? And as of right now, see when it came down below that red line? That's my sell signal. So I would have sold and waited for it to drop again, just like I did, and bought again at around 22-something, and it brought my average to 23. Now, you see the line has come down, and it's underneath our white line. Now, that's not necessarily good, but I see a curve in it right there. 
So what I'm anticipating it to do is something like this for tomorrow. All right, it should come up, bounce right here, and then ride the red line on back up. That's what I'm anticipating. Now, does it have to do that? No, it doesn't have to. I'm just starting to watch this ChatGPT AI moving average and seeing how it changes here and the results of everything as I'm doing it. So I'll be sharing this with y'all some more. I'll talk to y'all later. Love y'all. Be blessed. See you in the next video.